Mondays bring Steve Spangler and Today's the day we dress like science I, I guys. Wore, I wore my big boy clothes today. <laughs> Is that kind of nice? dressed up. We're not I, wearing I don't know why. I don't we don't. Feel, I I've don't. never worn a lab coat, really. Mm -hmm. Never done that. In all the school shows over the years, never worn a lab coat. Mr. Wizard, the original Mr. Wizard, gave me advice back in the 90s. Yeah. He says, dress like a regular person because science is supposed to be for regular. I, I thought it was good. I it love good it advice. when there are no goggles and Bunsen burners. Please, this it's is going to be more fun. You are going to be able to find, this is a diaper genie refill. Right. Okay. So uh, parents know about that. Sometimes I'll take teachers and uh, run them through like a department store and say, find as many science experiments as you can using household materials. This is a summer is thing one, you do, right? Uh, yeah, I do. Uh, when we teach our teachers in the summer. If I asked you to blow up a balloon, it would take take, I don't know, four or five breaths. If I asked you to blow up this bag, look at this, a giant sandwich bag. The question is, how many breaths would it take Tom Green to inflate the giant sandwich bag? A so, lot, more than on. I have. Here's what you're gonna do. Hold on to the end like this. I want you to put three breaths of air into the bag, okay? Look at you, this is good. One, two, <laughs> give me one more, give me one more. Good. Oh, that was good. That was good. So Look we this. almost did it. You, you, yeah, you're, you're almost there. We did it. So that's three. If you ask kids how many breaths does it take to blow up the bag, they go, I don't care. I just want the big bag. But most adults say, I'm not doing this. So this is three breaths. This is six. This is nine. This is 12. So I think it would be about 12 breaths. Okay. Okay. So if I told you, I bet you that I could do it in half that time, six breaths, you'd go, I would oh, laugh. Pretty good. Three breaths. I would uh, laugh. One single breath. Impossible. Would you would be buying the drinks that night. All right. So, so look at this. I, you put your mouth on that one. I'll show you this one. So here's the red one in comparison. So watch okay. how you do I just tied it off. Right. Hang just, on here. Okay. The secret is you can't use the air just from your lungs. If you blow on your hand like this, the air that you feel hitting your hand is a combination of the air from your lungs and the air on the outside following that it stream all goes of air. In. So, this is what you're gonna do. Instead of putting your hand on, you're gonna open the bag like this. Right. So you head off that way. This is gonna be hard to see. There you go, perfect. Now watch what I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna put my mouth on the bag, watch. Bingo. You did the whole thing. Fast moving air creates this area of low pressure. You can inflate the entire bag in a single breath of air. Try it, ready? And, and Who thought honestly, of that? Um, Thank you for asking. That's it's my buddy like Bernoulli. Like, it's Bernoulli. It's almost <laughs> like you read the script. I like that. <laughs> Hang on here. What, now, the hardest part is keep your mouth off the bag. Long okay. breath. Ready, set. <sighs> Seal the bag. Nice job. Hold it up. And the crowd goes wild with excitement. You can do it with a diaper genie refill. And I like this because once you do it with this, a kid will never look at a diaper genie refill the same <laughs> way again. Sure. They will destroy these for years and years and years to come. What a nice way to do it, though. Summer ideas for kids, for teachers as well, available Absolutely. where? Uh, just go to 9news.com, look for the Steve Spangler, or follow me on Facebook because we'll put all the stuff every time I'm on the show. If you just go to facebook.com slash Steve Spangler, I'll put all the stuff up there. Well, if only Bernoulli could be here today. To he watch is us. in spirit. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, Bernoulli. <laughs>